Kia ora all, welcome to Mr Quiz, the channel where we play quizzes. Great to see you again, thank you very much for tuning in. Uh, and uh, just a note to uh, my friend Sporkle Dork, well done on um, completing the challenge of naming all the countries in the world from largest to smallest. Not the easiest challenge I know, but you got there, so well done. Uh, today we're going to be making it a little bit easier. Uh, we're going to be uh, naming, trying to name the least populated mainland countries. So. I could try and name the least populated countries, but there would be a lot of island countries. This one is going to be a little bit more um, uh, possibly challenging, I suppose, or interesting, I would say, uh, because we're only looking at mainland countries. So none of the Caribbean countries, none of the small Pacific nations, um, not the Maldives, none of the small African nations. So without further ado, let's just jump into it and see how we get on. Uh, okay, cool. So uh, let's start with the Vatican City. We'll start with the European microstates. We've got six minutes. I think uh, 20 out of 20 should be possible here. Uh, Luxembourg. Yep, that's there. I was actually thinking it might be too big, but nope, it is there. Uh, let's do Monaco, San Marino, Andorra, and Liechtenstein. Great. Okay, that might be all of the European ones. Uh, the largest country on this list has 1.9 million people, so... Not sure how Kosovo would that fit in. It just sneaks in. Well, it's Slovenia. I think it's a little bit. Oh no, just over 1.988. So misses this list by about uh, what's that? 46,000 people, roughly. Uh, what else could be there then? Let's try Montenegro. It is there. Wow, I didn't realize Montenegro had such little people. 650,000. That's amazing. Uh, what about Asia then? Let's try Bhutan. Um, what about Kuwait. Uh, no, Qatar. Qatar is just too much. Uh, what about, I want to say Palestine, but there might be too many. And Bahrain, of course, is an island. Um, a lot of the countries have very small populations. Mongolia is sparsely populated, but I think it has, well, it must have more than 2 million. Okay, let's think about uh, Central America. We'll have Belize for sure. That is deceptively tiny. Um, Costa Rica, I think, might be a bit bigger. What about Panama, though? Okay. And El Salvador surely is bigger. However, Suriname might be on here. Perfect. Yeah, Suriname is deceptively small amount of people. And Guyana, maybe, as well. And what about Uruguay? I think it's more like 3 million in Uruguay. Maybe a few more. It's similar in population to um, Aotearoa. Okay, Gambia has quite a small country uh, population, but still quite large, almost 2 million. Uh, what about like Iswatini and Lesotho and Djibouti? Well, wow. almost too many people live in Lesotho in that small plate, uh, small uh, piece of land. That is amazing. Just goes to show you how densely populated Africa is, really. What about Togo? No. Uh, Guinea Bissau, possibly, though. And possibly Equatorial Guinea. I think it counts as a mainland country, perfect because there's a little speck on the mainland. This is going better than expected. Um, Brunei won't count because that's on an island. Right, this is how it's when it gets a little bit tough. What about if I go like Sierra Leone or Liberia? What else would be there in Africa? Oh, um, Botswana maybe? Yeah, oh, I was close. <laughs> it's deceptively um, oh, Namibia though. That's also oh, maybe more populated than I thought. Uh, what else? What else? What else? Uganda is big. Somalia is big. Kenya is big. Ethiopia is big. South Sudan? I think it'll be too many people. Mauritania is an outside chance. Just because it's mostly desert. Okay, what about Paraguay? No. That was going to be a hunt anyway. What about can I try, uh, Cambodia is going to have too many people. Oh, this is getting a bit difficult now isn't it? Let's try Turkmenistan. I think it'll be too many though. Same with Kyrgyzstan. Okay what about Lebanon? Oh Oman. Yeah it's, it's not as populated as people think but it's still reasonably populated. What about like Albania? or Moldova or Estonia okay perfect that's 14 that's only 1.25 million people live there okay so one more incidentally the last time I played this quiz it seems I got 19 out of 20 as well I wonder if it was the same one that I missed 
I'm thinking my best bet might be to stick in Europe here. Slovakia, I think it's going to be too big. You're probably screaming at the screen, telling me a European microstate that I missed. Uh, or something. Let's try Bosnia Herzegovina. And I don't, did I try Macedonia? I can't remember. Let's try it again. No, North Macedonia is just there. Croatia is unlikely. I think it's too many people in there. Oh gosh. So I've got 21, 22, 23, 24. I'm just missing 16. One minute to go. Ooh. Israel. Palestine. Jordan. No, no way. Um. Really, Zimbabwe's too many people. It's not going to be that. Gabon? <laughs> Gabon. Got there with, uh, what, 56 seconds to be Yeah, Gabon is one of those African countries which is um, deceptively underpopulated. Cool, that was a fun quiz. Uh, maybe we've got time for one more short one on this playlist I found, which is done by Sporkle EXP, all about world populations. Um, let's find one which is uh, short. Uh, that's countries with 1% of the world's population. That's basically the world's largest countries. Um, popular states of Mexico. Least popular state capitals. Least populated uh, European capitals. Let's give that a go. Uh, we've got 17 to get, and we're looking for the least populated capitals in Europe. Sure. Uh, well, we can start with the obvious ones again. Vatican City, Verduz and Liechtenstein, San Marino and San Marino. Monaco, uh, Andorra La Vea. Okay, then we're going to probably have Valletta and Malta. Excellent. Um, I'll try Ljubljana just because I remember that wasn't on the top um, 100 EU cities list. Uh, Luxembourg is probably going to be here. Okay, so the smallest one on this list is 431,000. So Skopje, we can use the um, knowledge we um, got on the last quiz. Uh, quiz. Uh, if it's unpopulated countries, it's likely to be unpopulated capitals as well. So Podgorica is there. Ljubljana, let's try Sarajevo, cool, um, Skopje wasn't, was it, uh, let's try Chisinau then, oh, I can't spell it, um, the problem was, one of my Romanian friends, um, taught me the pronunciation of Chisinau, is that it's C-H, no, C, it's like a C-I, but it's actually spelt C-H, and then the other part is, um, like it's S-H in English, but it's S-I. It's, yeah. <laughs> Let's try Helsinki, maybe. Uh, okay, but Tallinn should be here if Estonia is so small. I'll also try Riga and, uh, Vilnius. Okay, let's think about this. Dublin, no... Amsterdam, Brussels, Luxembourg, Lisbon, Madrid... Yeah, what about Bratislava? Okay, 429,000 people in Bratislava, that adds up. Budapest seems unlikely. Uh, Athens seems unlikely. Sofia, Bucharest, Tirana should be here then. Uh, what about this, like Zagreb? Nope. Belgrade, uh, Pristina should be here. Great. Okay, one is 55,000, one is 125,000, one is 134,000. Copenhagen is too big. Oslo, Stockholm, Helsinki, Riga, Vilnius, Warsaw is too big. Minsk, maybe. No. Oh gosh. Uh, Bern should be here. Yep, that's not the biggest city in Switzerland by any rate. Uh, Rome. Which one am I missing? Something obvious, huh? Uh, Nicosia, maybe? Okay, great, and one more, which is 125,000 people. Hmm, for some reason I feel like I'm missing one city in, um, in the Balkans. Let's just try Prague just to type something at the end, or Kiev. Nope, Reykjavik, yes. I forgot about it because it's all the way out here, or here. <laughs> Um, on its own little island, literally. And of course we didn't get to it in the last quiz because we didn't look about islands. Anyway, thank you very much for tuning in this far. 
watching the two quizzes. Um, if you could, please subscribe. If you haven't already, that would be amazing. And uh, yeah, share, share these quizzes with your friends and family and loved ones, if you like. Anyway, I'll see you next time, guys. Kakitiano. Bye.